guys. Totoo lang. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ito, there's a question. Actually, I'm not gonna say the names na lang from who's to pay them, just in case. Um, I have been prescribed medication for my mental health, but my parents are telling me to, that I should have enough faith to get over it without using medication. What do you guys think? Ooh, that's so hard when you mix faith with science. Yeah, and parents. And parents. I feel really bad for this, this, I don't know if it's a guy or this son or daughter going through it, because, like, I, I actually dealt with this as well. I was, I was on staff at a church. I'm working for a church, I'm the director of operations, and I'm going through depression, and everyone's like, wait, shouldn't you be, like, good, like, you love God, like, but it's, it's more than that, like, it's just like, what if you, if you're, if you go to church and you're not gonna get, like, COVID, or you're not gonna get a cold, it's, something we have to deal with and it's something we walk through so and guys vacation is also a creation that was made by men that men god put men on the earth to, to help us like healing doesn't always come in this like we'll just believe it to be done in way like it could be through medication and modern day medicine so i wouldn't discount it that's my opinion and again it's a freaking chemical imbalance it's not because you don't have faith God, it's because uh-huh. what I'm again, I got imbalance in the brain. That's can I ask something. you guys? Yeah. Is that a thing with like, and you guys can correct me if I'm wrong, please do. Is it an older generation thing where they think, you know, it's all in your head and and, and is it in this country a lot more than it might be in other countries? Yeah. There's this one time, I don't know if you know this, Alexa, but a famous afternoon personality said something on uh afternoon show that was like I don't believe in depression and gawa gawa ng so utak niya you know who I'm talking about so familiar not in our channel oh my god but yeah like, you know what I mean that's that's that caused a little bit of an uproar because like bro yeah you wanna, we need to take the longest running shows away, in the Philippines guys. a lot of people watching the show and you're saying things like that but there are people who are in that depression yeah. and I, yeah. I, I hate it yeah, yeah. Especially yung mga older people then who grew up, you know, next to their Catholic then. It's something that's so new to them. It's just because they aren't as educated as they should be about it. That's why you we're talking about it now. That's yeah. why people other people are trying to make it an open topic. Para may tindihan din nila. Like my 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 mom, for example, she didn't really get it before when I would say na I I don't well and she'd be like oh that's nothing make a cake you'll be fine and then now she understands that oh i'm actually legit diagnosed i have to take my meds and now she's not supportive always checking on me be careful with what she says so i think we just have to educate people thankfully our country is making progress yeah. regarding mental health so small steps are still honestly giant leaps for me because that is really close mind that can happen. Maybe depression is really nice, but they think, well, it's not real. No, I got that to get attention. So at least now, yeah, at least we just open our eyes and our minds to the world that it's it's a real deal and it can really f you up. Totally, I think it's a. Uh... It's extremely important for us to continue.